everyone, welcome back to another video here on my channel and yet another video from my shooting series. Today I'm going to declare the end of my cut and I'm going to make a photo shoot with my dear friend whose Instagram I'm going to put right here so you can follow him. I have put it before but if you still haven't followed him, go and do so because he makes a lot of good photos. But however, today we're going to make a photo shoot, I'm going to take you with me and after the photo shoot I'm going to go back to normal but I'm not just going to spike up the calories and the carbohydrates and everything and just go out of my cut as this may make me gain fat which I don't want. I'm going to use a technique and I'm going to show you this technique and I'm going to explain how it works but this is going to happen in another video. Today I'm going to take you with me on a photo shoot and it's going to be something more of a vlog. So I'm not going to waste your time anymore. Let's firstly see what I'm going to eat for breakfast before the photo shoot. Alright, so let me explain. Firstly, you need to bear with me right here, alright? So, I'm going to have chicken and rice, not for the reason that I'm eating chicken and rice 24-7, but because the rice is white and it doesn't have a lot of fiber, and the chicken has mainly protein and not a lot of fats. So, now for breakfast, I'll need almost no fiber, because fiber will make me bloat, and I don't want to look bloated for my photo shoot and I don't want any fat with my carbs because this is going to also make me not feel that well and maybe my veins won't pop out that much so I'll try to eat that and it's going to be maybe my best bet by the way guys this is not the only thing that I ate this morning I haven't shown you that I drank one lemon and also right now I'm making some green tea and I'm doing these two things because actually they both are diuretics and a diuretic is a thing that rids your body of excess water and salt so it's amazing for me because this is also going to make me bloat and retain water which I don't certainly want for my photo shoots or ever to look good so I'm doing these two things I'm eating that and then I'm preparing to go out I'm going to get my backpack everything ready and then I'm going to go and I'm going to get you with me as I said so now let's eat and then prepare For the past week I haven't eaten almost any carbs, I mean mainly from vegetables and right now this rice feels so good! Alright guys, I'm in the park, right now I'm going to carb up my body before the photo shoot. I know it looks disgusting, probably, but it's going to be amazing, especially that I haven't eaten any carbs now. Sweet Jesus, I'm going to eat that and then we're going to continue with the shoot. Alright people, we are done and I think we can call it a day. Now I'm ready, I'm going to go home. Just look at this view, it's amazing. Just let me try and yeah. I tried to make a montage, I hope it looks good. Right now I'm starving, I want water because until now I haven't drunk any in order to not retain any water. Yeah, I know it sounds stupid but I have been drinking a lot of water recently in order to do that this day. So now I can calmly go home and stuff myself up with carbs. Nah, I'm just kidding, I'm not going to eat that much carbs, but I'm going to enjoy some food right now, guys. I'm happy, I feel good, and I hope that you feel good as well. Now, I'm going to go home. Alright everyone, it's the morning, it's the next day, and my hair probably looks curlier than ever, and this is because I practically just woke up. But however, let me explain why I didn't I record this part of the video yesterday. It was simply because Yesterday was my name day and no, don't worry, you didn't need to wish me anything because it's not that much of a big deal But me and my family celebrated, we gathered, we ate, you know, all of that good stuff So today I'm going to just finish the video, 
And what I want to say in this part of the video is why did I stop with my cut? Well guys, three or four days prior to this one, I weighed myself and what the scale said was really surprising to me because this was actually my goal. I hope that this footage is good because it was when I was going to school and I was in a hurry so I tried my best in order for it to be recognizable but if you can see good there on the scale is written 73 kilograms guys and this is my goal and also I reached 9% of body fat percentage so I'm really proud with this success and I am satisfied with it even though you shouldn't say that you are satisfied and all of this Boot, quite honestly but I reached my goal and I'm not going to keep putting my body under starvation mode because I'm tired of all of this I feel tired all the time I can't sleep all of these things make me go crazy so now I'm just going to enjoy life I'm going to start maintaining my weight and then start gaining weight but this is going to happen in other videos I'm going to keep you updated with my life of course as I always do but now when I go back to normal I'm going to use a technique called reverse dieting and I'm going to make a video on this one as well but obviously I'm not going to do that in this video because if I do so it's going to be 30 minutes or even more so let's not go crazy on it and I'm just going to say goodbye right now because there is nothing much more to say so guys thank you for watching of course if you enjoyed the video don't forget to give it a like and also subscribe for my channel and turn on the little bell bell so you can see my upcoming videos and also guys the comment section down below is for you also don't be shy go there write something whatever you want and then i would appreciate that so guys now thank you for watching stay healthy stay positive and because this tripod is really heavy and it's far away from me i'll see you in the next one